Hey guys, my name is Koozie. Thank you so much for clicking on this video. I hope you enjoy it. Now this is going to kind of be a part 2 video to my previous video, 5 times players in Overwatch, because I primarily just ranted the entire time. And that's kind of what this video is, just ranting. Not about specific players, just, just game mechanics. And yeah, I hope you guys enjoy it. Without any further ado, let's get straight into the video, guys. Now, I don't know if this is just me, but I seem to be pretty unlucky when it comes to Overwatch. I'm not necessarily talking about loot boxes when I say that I'm unlucky, although I've never gotten a legendary. I'm mainly talking about who ends up being on my team. Now, like I said before, I don't know if this is just me, but it always seems like there's someone on my team who's playing a specific hero, and they're just learning how to crouch. They are garbage at the game, and they're just trying to get a spawn. That's all they're trying to do. While there's someone on the other team who's playing the exact same hero, and he's this god-tier deity of Overwatch, just destroying our entire team. Now, for those of you who are like me and play an extremely squishy character, Roadhog can be an absolute nightmare. And if you play Overwatch in general, Roadhog's hook can be an absolute nightmare too. Now I know everyone's been in this situation before. You're running away from the hog himself. You just got behind a wall. You're all good. You're safe. You're in the clear. Nope, just kidding. You just get fucking hooked through a wall. Roadhog is easily the most broken character in Overwatch. And Blizzard has done absolutely fucking nothing to try and fix it. I don't even think they care. I just think it's funny to them. And honestly, in my own opinion, there's a lot more that's broken about Roadhog than just his hook. Roadhog is easily one of the biggest characters in the game, but yet surprisingly moves extremely quick for his size. On top of this, his self-heal can heal up to 50% for his health. It's probably just me, but Roadhog is a bitch to deal with. And don't even get me started about Roadhog in 3v3. Alright, moving on though, we have Pro Hanzo himself, the Master Bowman. Now there's not a lot of Pro Hanzos out there, but if you're unlucky enough to get into a game against one, it's probably safe just to back out as soon as you can. These guys do not miss their shots, and they're fucking robots that just don't miss. They cannot, they have to try to miss. I don't even know how people play Hanzo in general, because whenever I try to, my finger always hurts from holding down his arrows. Now this next one I'm kind of guilty of because I do it a lot myself and it's a ton of fun to play this hero just because of this ability. But when it happens to you it is super frustrating and it feels like it lasts forever. I'm sure you guys already know who I'm talking about. It's none other than Ana. Now honestly if she hits you with her sleep dart it's only going to knock you out for at least I think it's 5 seconds. But that doesn't matter because it feels like it's 2 hours long. It feels like it's the entire game. And speaking of abilities that are fun to use, but not fun to be used on, we have Mei. And also, just like Ana, when you get frozen by Mei, it feels like it lasts the entire game, even though it's only a couple seconds. It's kind of like falling in quicksand, because you know you're gonna die, and there's nothing you can do about it, so you just have to wait for your death in the most unpleasant way possible. While we're on the topic of unpleasant things though, I have to bring up Lucio and his slippery grease covered ass, cause he is the hardest person to kill I've ever experienced. Roadhog is easier to kill than Lucio for me. So with the new update, you get your ultimate a lot less than you used to, so that kind of forces you to use it more conservatively. And I don't think there's anything more disappointing than wasting that ultimate that you get. Whether you're just a shitty player and get no kills with it, or you're just you're McCree and you go for the high noon but just get shut down while you're trying to charge up, it sucks. It really sucks. Not only do you hate yourself, your team hates you as well. <laughs> Alright, so I'm going to wrap this up here because quite honest, I'm running out of things to say. But if I miss something that aggravates you in Overwatch, feel free to leave it in the comment section and you might see it in a follow-up video to this. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. You know, the whole, the whole deal with the likes and subs. That's greatly appreciated. Anyways, I'll see you next time. Bye-bye, boy. February, weather scary. I need notes on how to live. Call my mama, always drama. She need money for them kids. Another tour, another war. I sold my soul, I hit a lick. If I die and go to hell, I swear to God I'm gonna be pissed.